You're trifling, good for nothing type of brother. Why haven't I found another a baller? So it's Emma. So today I'm going to be doing a What's on my iPhone 2017 video. I hope you guys enjoy. If you're new to my channel, hi, I'm Emma. I make videos every week about beauty, fashion, lifestyle, and just kind of weird videos. So if you are into that kind of stuff, go ahead and click the subscribe button down below. Oh, I cannot talk today. So I just got a new phone and I have the iPhone 7 Plus in rose gold. I also have this case. I don't know where it's from. It's from Sonics with an X. It's see-through and it's got these flowers and leaves on it. I don't know if you can see it that much. Um, but then I also have a magnet in the back of my phone that like props up on my dash so I can like use GPS and it's not like dangerous. So this is my screensaver. Um, it's me and my best friend, Rachel. Um, we took this while we were at a lake with our friends. Here is the first screen and this is my boring screen. This is all like just boring stuff. So first in the little like the little bar on the bottom. I have Instagram, messages, Google, and music. And my Instagram is Emma Jensen YT for you guys who want to go follow it. I post almost every day. I try to every day. Sometimes I forget. Um, but yeah, that is that. So then on, on this page, I have a phone, contacts, calendar, which I actually use calendar for scheduling like videos and that kind of stuff and also just kind of keeping track of my friends and all that kind of stuff and when we're hanging out and all that jazz. Then I have FaceTime which I used to not use a lot but now me and my friend like use it like occasionally so like I have it out now. Um, clock I use that for um, when I have to get up in the morning or when I have to like time something. Um, self-explanatory but I usually use it during the school time and not summer. <laughs> I then have my app store, iTunes store, settings, just kind of boring things. Then I have my notes. I'm not going to open them up because some of them are like video ideas and stuff but oh my gosh my nose itches just so bad oh my goodness. So then in my school folder I have everything that I need for school. I have my calculator, a dictionary light, campus portal which is where I check my grades that kind of stuff. Um, Word Reference and Google Translate are both for Spanish. I hate Spanish, so I need those to help me translate. Then I have a shopping folder, and this has all of my, like, when I buy stuff and to see how much money I have on my card and that kind of stuff. And then I have a miscellaneous folder, and this has Safari, Find My iPhone, Home, Wallet, TV, Find Friends, Watch, Podcast Tips, Compass, iBooks, Docs, Voice Memos, Health, news, mail, and maps. Just things I don't really use that much. I should probably take maps out of that folder and put it on my home screen. But. So then on this page, I have Twitter, which my Twitter is at it's Emma Jensen, I'm pretty sure. Yes, it is at it's Emma Jensen, and that's that. Um, then I have Snapchat, which, oh, that's me. Okay, hold on, I need to... Okay, so <laughs> this is you guys. Um, so that's my Snapchat. If you want to add me on Snapchat, there is my username. Then I have YouTube for obvious reasons. Like, I do YouTube, so I have to have it. I usually watch videos um, on the daily, every day. Um, so yeah. Then I have Studio. This is an easy way for me to reply to comments because sometimes I'm not by a computer and I need to reply to you guys. So that's where I usually reply to comments, but that's really all that I use it for. Um, I have Facebook, Tumblr, Pinterest, Gmail, Weather, which where I live, Weather is a little out of the whack, so I need to have this on my home screen. I have Twitch because um, I watch uh, The Sims 3, I watch people play The Sims 3, but there's one girl in particular, Girl Meets Pixels, she's like the best at it, so I always watch her live streams. So if I'm ever not home while she's live streaming, I have it on my phone so I can watch her, if that makes sense. Then I have Netflix, which I've been obsessed with The Office lately. Um, I never really liked it, and then I started watching it, and I was like, oh, this is really good. I'm addicted now, so that's how that happened. Then I have SoundCloud. I just use SoundCloud for, um, I'm actually probably not logged in, but I am. 
Um, I use SoundCloud just for podcasts and for songs that are on iTunes. There's a lot of artists that don't put their songs on iTunes and put them on SoundCloud instead. It's usually artists that aren't as big. So yeah, that's what I have that for. Then I have Swerk It, which is my workout app. If you guys want me to do a workout routine for 2017, I would love to. I've been working out every day um, for the past week and a half, I would say. Maybe, maybe just a full week, but I've been loving it and I actually feel really good. So if you guys want a workout routine, what I do, all that kind of stuff, I can, I can make that. Just give me a like and leave a comment down below telling me you want that. Then I have this nightlight app. Okay, hear me out. It is really dark in my new room and my new room is not even that new. Like I've had it for a while. But when all the lights are off and it's dark outside, it's so dark in here. And so I have this for when I can't sleep. I just turn it on and turn the timer on and it shuts off after like 30 minutes. And usually by that time I'm right out. Then I have my reminders which I actually moved up onto this screen because every day I have been, um, not every day, like every other day, I have been, what's it called? A quote. That quote um, is a Bible verse not really a quote, it's a Bible verse, and it really just like strengthens me. I have a lot of anxiety, and I thought about doing a video about like how I deal with my anxiety and that kind of stuff. These just like calm me and make me feel like I'm just, I'm, it's everything's fine, nothing's wrong, like you can, you can do it, you're great, you're good. So, yeah. Then, um, I have my photo and video folder. Um, I have photos and camera which come with the phone obviously and then I have Visco. If you guys want to follow my Visco, I'll put it in the description but this is just a sneak preview I guess. Um, then I have Facetune. I use this to whiten the back of pictures like walls that are like orange, orange tint. Like those don't look good on my feet sometimes so I need to have that whitening tool. Then they have layout by Instagram and boomerang by Instagram. Layout is obviously a collage and boomerang of those little videos that are like this if you're not in the loop. Um, Moldiv is another collage app. I really like it so I, I've kept it. Um, Bitmoji which is for Snapchat and Splice which is a video editor which I use to make short videos fit on Instagram. If that makes sense. Then I have a games folder which honestly is very anticlimactic because I have two things in here and I barely use them. I have 2048, which <laughs> is a game I'm pretty sure like all of you guys know. Um, and you just move the blocks so they, okay, add, whatever, <laughs> and they go like this. So yeah, it's, it's really a boring game, but when you're stuck in class and you have nothing else to do, this is like, it saves your life. Um, and then I have Recolor, which is actually a coloring app, and I love it so much. These are <laughs> mine. Um, when I'm bored or have anxiety, it works, so I just do it. So that is all that is on my iPhone for 2017. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up and leave a like. What? That is the same thing. Please leave a like and a comment down below telling me your favorite app on your phone. Let me know, I need more apps. As you can see, I need more games. So maybe give me a game suggestion. Make sure you subscribe to my channel down below for videos every week. I love you guys so much and I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace on the streets. <laughs>